great. It fits right in that box. It's quite a light machine. Nice, nice simple setup. I like how it's just in the one carry case. It's still one man portable. It feels nice and solid, but it's not too heavy. The tether setup is nice and simple. The grabber arm is, is a simple uh, release pin there. That took probably under a minute, to be honest, to, to be fully set up and ready, so. Really nice clear picture. It's got a great smooth motion to it. Holds its depth really well. I like how it's such a portable machine, you know, you can launch it just one person, but yet in the water it feels so solid. Really nice lateral movement. And the fact that you can change the speed gain of it is a really nice feature. I do a lot of civil infrastructure inspections and tank inspections and having that lateral movement for an inspection is really key because it's giving you a nice smooth video. The depth holding is excellent, so that's a really, really nice feature and the fact that you can slow it right down, speed it up, will be hugely beneficial to civil infrastructure inspections. The sonar feature on the pivot is definitely beneficial in Ontario waters that I work in. A lot of the waters are, are very turbid a lot of changing underwater environments, so that sonar is definitely very beneficial to that kind of work. All right, really impressive. It's, it's a nice solid machine in the water. It's still one man portable, which is key for our ROV services. It feels really good on the controller. It's nice smooth movements. I think it's uh, a great tool for inspection and survey ROV work where you want to keep that small footprint on site, so very exciting. <laughs>